distract you. I'm gonna yell something as a joke. Watch out for that truck! <laughs> Hello everyone, I've been working, but I have a small little break. I have a special someone I need to go get a gift for, so I'm getting the kids together, getting in the car. Hey Kirby Doo, he's in the middle of getting dressed still. We're gonna head out, we're gonna go get a fun little treat. Maddie's here, so that makes everything better. So we're going into Holzer right now. We're gonna get a birthday present for Kate. Neighbor. Our babysitter. lovely neighbor and babysitter. She babysits Maddie all the time. <laughs> yes, my favorite babysitter. Then we might go get a treat or something. Always. So we may have gotten a little distracted while we're here. Maddie, what do you think? I could ask him. That is way cute. I like that one better. You guys, we're contemplating right now. Should we do family pictures this weekend while Maddie's here? Comment below. Should we do family pictures? Do you want to see this beautiful girl give photos taken of her? I'll ask them if they have an extra small. What turned into buying a simple gift has now turned into us shopping. I'm so sorry, Brandon. When Maddie comes into town, it's just something that happens. No, we haven't actually found anything to buy. We're fine. We're looking for a dress in Maddie's size. I got this wild hair as we were driving there. I was like, maybe I should do family pictures this weekend because Maddie's here and then I don't have to pay for a flight, do all of that. I can just do family pictures. So we're trying to find a day and time that works for Brandon's sister. You guys all know Michelle. She's just incredible. So that could be kind of awesome. Maddie, I like this one. Hazy, what is that? It's a backpack to go to school. And it's pink, I love it. Maddie is trying on more clothes, more dresses. We're trying to find something. If we can find a couple winning pieces, I'll go, okay, we can do this for family pictures. But if not, we're just gonna bag it because it's not worth the extra stress. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, here's a good option, here's a good option. I like this one a lot, Maddie. Ooh, sneak peek, you guys. What is Maddie gonna be wearing for family pictures if we do them? This has a fun little print though. I like it. What'd we get? We got Miss Cute Kate a gift, huh? Well, what, what is it? It's a gift card and a cute little bracelet. We are not sure exactly what dress we're gonna buy for family pictures, so we're gonna put a temporary hold for this very moment and come back later and find family picture outfits. But you guys, I think we're gonna try and do it. Comment below if you think we should do family pictures. It's getting that time of year again, and I don't love winter pictures, and I don't want super summery pictures. I want like in between, so I think we're gonna head up the mountains, get some beautiful ones. I gotta convince Brandon. I know all of you are very excited Maddie's back. I, for one, am ecstatic about that. First of all, because our house is complete, Oh. And second of all, because we get to watch a scary movie that we've been waiting to watch for a long time. We promised, we swore to each other we would not watch it. Did you watch it, by the way? No, did right, you? Go. No, I didn't, I swear. I don't want you to feel bad if you did. At the same time, I'd be a little bit hurt because we've been waiting to watch Truth or Dare together. Looks pretty trippy, pretty creepy, and it's one of our favorite things to do is to watch a scary movie at night. But I thought, if you guys don't know this, first of all, let me catch up to speed here. This little one is 15 turning 16. Not so little, you guys. And so, as such, she is now a permitted driver. Not like license driver. You do yeah. not have a driver's license. Close. You do have a permit. I do. So I thought tonight when we go get our truth or dare movie, our scary movie to watch, let's start off with something even more scary. Let's have you <laughs> drive the truck to the Walmart to pick up the red box. What do you think about that? <laughs> I mean, we could give it a try. I definitely think I, I haven't driven for a long time, so oh. I think I need to like practice. You want to do some practice? Yeah. We can practice. We don't, we don't have to like start off with the truck. Let's, let's start with something a little smaller. Yeah. Well, stay in your lane. Blinker, blinker. Maddie, no joke. I thought you did pretty good. I think you're ready, guys. What do you think? Comment below. Is Maddie ready to drive the truck? Let us know. <laughs> I think that practice run, you went all the way across the street, you stayed in your lane, you used your blinker, and you stopped appropriately at the curb. So I want to say you're ready. Before that, let's go get something to eat because I'm starving. But guys, here's what's going down tonight. Mom is off doing some fun stuff with the kids. She may or may not be getting ready for the potential family pictures coming up. Please comment below. Should we do family pictures? And please comment no. And <laughs> we're not like super huge fans, but we love how they look when they turn out. It's all the work's on mom. Let's be honest. It's not a lot of work yeah. on us. It's not hard for us. We just have to show up, but it kind of stresses mom out a little bit. So we'll see. Let us know. Comment below. But she may or may not be doing some outfit selecting right now. So we thought we would do some fun daddy daughter time because we just don't get to get enough of that. We don't yeah. get enough of that. I mean, you can never have enough of that, honestly. Never. So we're gonna go get some fun dinner at a place called Gandolfo's, and it's like a sandwich shop. Maddie was in the mood for a turkey sandwich, and I, was. I love this sandwich joint. So we're gonna go get a sandwich. We're gonna go have some fun at the park at a neighborhood activity with some young men and young women. That's right, I said young men. And then <laughs> We're gonna go pick up our red box and at that moment Maddie's gonna take over the steering wheel of this car and drive it straight off a cliff. Mm. No, and dri <laughs> drive it straight down to Walmart and we're gonna get this red box. Anyways, look at something to eat, okay? Okay! <laughs> I 
right, guys. Wonderful, wonderful dinner. Fun place. Great conversation. It was just awesome sitting and talking to Maddie about all things life. And can I just tell you guys, she's an amazing gal. You guys know this, but she is incredible. Mature beyond her years, just absolutely level-headed, feet just firmly planted on the ground. I love it. I love it. You are an amazing kid. Thanks. You just are. It was, so nice. it was an absolutely <laughs> rewarding conversation as a father to talk to his daughter. And it was just very rewarding and fulfilling for me. That was awesome. So we are now at the activity portion of our night. We got some fun games out here, dunk tank, things like that. So I'm going to have Maddie go in the dunk tank. And then I, <laughs> just kidding, we're not doing that. But you guys, the moment we've all been waiting for is coming up very shortly. From here, we are going out. Oh, by the way, I just downloaded Avengers Infinity War while we were at dinner. Pretty stoked. We're going to be no watching that as well. Not tonight, but another night this week, we're going to be watching that one. We're going to go pick up our scary movie, Truth or Dare. That's not what we're playing. It's the movie we're watching. Yes. That's coming up next. Maddie will be driving there. Stay tuned. No joke. If you haven't watched yesterday's video, go check it out. Epic slip and slide. World's biggest. Insane. That's yeah. awesome. We had a snow cone. But, <laughs> but you guys, no joke. My entire rib cage is bruised, hurting. Something's up with it. My yeah. hip bone kills like crazy. Some yeah. of my skin's missing. Oh. Can't it got really. it got intense. It got I so intense. Have a little bruise. As we're doing these little games out here, my sides hurt. I just jumped up on that ball like a savage. And <laughs> Even laughing right now. It hurts so bad to laugh. Oh, ah. Anyways, totally <laughs> worth it because we had so much fun. Crew yeah. surfing on my back. It was amazing. If you haven't seen that video, go check it out. This is it. Oh boy. Guys, this is uh, the. This is in my hands. Both of my babies <laughs> are right now. Okay, so this is the state the truck was in. Now let's see what state it ends up in. <laughs> Can I actually say, I don't think I've been the passenger in this truck before. Oh my gosh, what are you doing? Just kidding. It's been a long, long time since I've been driver's ed. As you guys know, I just celebrated a pretty important birthday, my 40th. So it's been a little while, but we're gonna walk through some of the do's and don'ts of driving to get a scary movie at Redbox. Yes. So do adjust your seat and mirrors so that you're comfortable. Oh, I Because I am pretty tall, mirrors. so adjust your mirrors, both oh. side views and here, let's put the keys in and start oh, it up. Just get some power going. Okay. Guys, she does have a permit. I know that I said she doesn't have a license, which is true, she doesn't, but she has a permit. This is all legal. So is turn it all the way forward. Now you gotta go a little bit more. Oh, you have there to you go. like put some effort yep. into it. Your seatbelt's on, right? Okay. But yours isn't. Oh, shoot, yeah. <laughs> Switch left or right on that. Oh, is this the Yeah, there you go. Oh, gotcha. Doing pretty good. Oh, sorry, I'm probably in the way of that one. You guys, she has a small compact car at home, and so she's done some practicing, but mostly in smaller cars. As you guys know, this truck sits a little bit higher, so you're kind of a little bit, uh, a little bit different experience here as we drive away in the truck. Yes, I'm interested to see how it feels. So I never have the parking brake on, so you don't have to worry about that. Oh. <laughs> Foot on the brake, throw it in the drive, and let's get out of here. You ready? Yeah. Do you feel like you're a good spot? Close enough? Mm -hmm. Like, is the seat adjusted how you like it? Does yeah. everything feel good? Okay, I love you. It's the last so time I tell you. I love I'm you. I'm used to the Prindle thing being right here. Yes, sorry. But... This is kind of weird. It's trucky. The truck. So you just go down to the oh. D right there. There you go, yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm not even nervous, but I feel like I should be. And it's got some good power, so just make sure you go nice and oh, slow. Yeah. You can honestly probably roll through here with your foot just gently on the brake mm -hmm. because like there's always so many kids running around. Right, yeah. It's a little slow. Oh, this steering wheel turns really easily. The steering wheel is really touchy. It is. Sorry it is. if I like if you like bounce a lot on the brakes and stuff because nope it's totally different experience than what you've practiced since so don't even sweat it well plus i do that anyways so you're gonna go around this truck and then turn right here still getting used to it i love that blinker i haven't used a blinker on the street yet that's good appropriate driving that was the thumbnail i just did a scare face while you drive <laughs> <laughs> doing amazing so far. Quick update, still alive and killing it. You are doing really good though. Really good. Thanks. Feeling good. So you're going to enter this roundabout thing and basically take your first one down this hill. I'm going to slow down a lot. Yeah. And then you just make sure there's nobody in it. Go Wait, right so through. where am I going? Straight down this way. Just go down this hill right here. So far, so good. Read them at 25. Just say, don't worry about being super precise on like fitting perfectly in the lanes or going exactly the speed limit. Just kind of let it flow. This thing right here is going to tell you how fast you're going. 27, 26. But, oh, 25! Hey. Don't worry. Like like right now, I know it's kind of tough because there's cars on the side of the road, but you're like, yeah, I don't want to cross the yellow line. huge, yeah. Don't even sweat it. Like if there's no cars over there, just don't hit those cars. You can go on that line. Speed you know. bump. Lots of huge speed bumps yeah, coming up. Yeah, those are huge. So we're just going straight. And you're gonna turn right actually. And uh, I saw somebody crossing the street. Okay, you're good. Guys, she is killing it right now. If her driver's ed teacher is watching, A plus plus, check plus. You're making Kathy proud. Kathy, you've done good. Don't hit cars on the side of the road. Yes. Cause I've done that. Just go straight. Keep driving. I'm just gonna try and 
distract you. I'm gonna yell something as a joke. Watch out for that truck! <laughs> <laughs> I told you I was gonna do it. Okay, okay, so <laughs> this is a stop sign, so stop at this I one. I see the stop okay, sign. Okay, okay. I saw the sign. Straight. And then you're still gonna go straight, yep. Mm -hmm. and you're gonna enter a little more highly trafficked roundabout. That one usually has a few more people in it, but you're good on the stop. You know the full three seconds, because that's what you're gonna have to do in your test, but just so you yes. know, nobody does that in real life. It's true. The California roll. <laughs> hey, is that where they got that sushi from? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Dad jokes. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Guys, we're almost there. Down just like out that way? Yeah. It's like making a right hand turn, but you're using the circle. Okay. I'm gonna go nice and slow. Yep, nice and easy. I don't see and any. And I see no cars, so I think you're good. I cannot park in this truck to save my life. It's too big. I'm not used to it yet. I've always <laughs> driven small cars. You're gonna turn right into the parking lot. Be extra cautious in here because there's tons of people walking in and out of the store. Cars coming in and out. Be aware of that, but let's go find a spot kind of far out to park so we don't try and squish you in between two cars. So I would say go through here just slowly as, as people walk out and we'll go past like the main entrance and then there's a lot of open spots down there. Stop for this guy. Oh, yes. Yes, guys, we're getting ice cream. Now, I know this is going to come as a large disappointment to many of you. Normally, it's cotton candy ice cream with rainbow sprinkles, but we are shaking things up tonight because you know what? My daughter's driving my truck. That's a very big deal, so we're going to switch it up tonight. I'm going to get, I don't know what I decided. What was I getting? Do you want me to go in? Yeah, just go right out here, yeah. Don't worry, guys, though. There will be a cookie dough and brownies and all Oh, all that, that good involved, stuff. So yes, I think she's going to maybe either get the Jimmy Fallon or the Half Baked Ben and Jerry's. Not. I may be getting like a Dulce de Leche. Hagen is one of my favorites. Can't quite decide. We're going to go in and check that out. So I would grab any one of these parking spots, maybe one of the Seven you just passed, those have been good, less of a walk, but this is gonna help us burn our ice cream calories. You're in a couple of them. <laughs> just kidding, you're actually doing really good. So if you wanna straighten it out, you can go in reverse and turn the wheel the other way and straighten it out, or you can just leave it, that's why we chose to park this far away. I mean, we could- you Wanna try it? Practice doing that. So this is going and just use this camera, and then also your side mirrors, of course. So do I wanna, I always get So you're gonna go the opposite way, so go this way, way so yep. That I turn out. And this actually is cool because this is gonna help you, you don't get too used to that, but that's gonna show you where you're going, the white lines. That's really so as you move it, but also make sure you're checking your sides, yeah. yeah. Yep. Keep it turning though, because you're still crooked. You wanna get us to where we're straight, and then you can come back into the space. Uh, so crank it pretty hard that way. Okay, I was not really Or if you wanna get super tricky, we could back into a spot. There we go. Go straight into here, yeah, just turn it the other way. And I'll give it a good crank, because by the time you get going, you want it to be facing the other way. There you go, and your money, and s boom. Or there. Did I hit the curb? No, I don't know. I don't. I can't tell if you hit the curb if you just hit on the brake hard. Where Boom. is the parking brake though? Uh, so that's weird. You just push that button and it's on. And now it's off. It's just a button. <laughs> don't forget to take it off because I never ever remember to put it on. Okay. <laughs> we made it. We made Are you it. kidding me? Oh, it's super easy, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Guys, parking a big fat truck for the first time in our life right in the lines, in the lines, right to the curb. Are you kidding me right now? Look at this. I mean, there's a little extra space on this yeah, side, but, but you're mean, inside I'm of it. In a That's a big space. deal. You're inside of a parking space. Can I drive? We made sure that there was like really no risk, <laughs> as I you can mean, see. However, you nailed it. You nailed it. I just want to get some perspective here. There we go. <laughs> it was really hard to find a parking space. She parked that. She <laughs> Nice job, Maddie. All right, you guys, it's the moment of truth or dare. <laughs> rent it now, they don't have Blu-ray. I'm not gonna rent anything with Blu-ray, so I'm kind of a snob like that. Let's go over here. <laughs> gonna be sad if nobody has it. Might be doing a digital rental on this one. <laughs> Maddie's gonna break down her favorite two for us right now. Okay, so we're thinking half-baked, but the other option is the Tonight Dough. The Tonight Dough, Jimmy Fallon's favorite. Okay, what are the differences or similarities? What's in both of them, so I guess? So they both have cookie dough. Solid, I'm a huge cookie dough fan. This one has like chocolate cookie dough too and peanut butter cookie dough. Whoa. This whoa. one has brownies. Whoa. So you can't go wrong with either of those. You can't go wrong with either. Tonight we're gonna do we're each gonna get our own ice cream tonight and eat that while we watch our movie. What is your choice for tonight? That looks good and so is chubby hubby. Chubby hubby? That's what Mindy calls me. That's so cute. I'm thinking I'm gonna go with half baked. You can't go wrong with half baked. Honestly I would eat all of these. I mean you could get both but then we'll probably eat both and that's not great for one night. Okay let's go half baked for you on that one tonight this. and then oh Caramel, anything caramel is gonna get me, and peanut butter also. Let me show you guys my personal favorite that I get every time. It's not nearly you as could fun. Even add sprinkles to that I feel like I could. I always get Hagen Dazs Dulce de Leche, my absolute favorite ice cream on the planet. It's just kind of plain in comparison to all your fun chunks of cookie dough and brownie and peanut butter, and there's so much to yours. This is just ice cream. I don't know. Could I add sprinkles to Dulce de Leche? Is that weird? This one that I had in Tahoe, it's unreal. Tempted by the Talenti right now. I don't know why, and I can't believe I'm saying this, but I don't. I don't feel like these would make good ice cream. <laughs> At least not the Sour Patch. Not the Sour Patch, yeah, I would try Butterfinger all day. Birthday cake, always an option. This little guy right here feeling kinda left out. We're sorry, we can see the tears freezing to the side of your case. We're not going with you tonight. But it's not you, it's you. us. We do love you, we'll be back. It's not a goodbye, it's just like see you later. We'll be back for you, not tonight. 
Goodbye, my love. Look at Tillamook just like changing up the ice cream game. Caramel toffee crunch, PB&J, creamy PB&J. Maddie made a great observation on some of those, like Tillamook and some of the others. You really don't get as many chunks, right? Like a, yeah. uh, the bits or whatever. It's more ice cream. We want more. And like a, like a tad bit, like stuff. a little piece of cookie dough or a chocolate chip here and there, but like you go with uh -huh. the Ben & Jerry's, it's chock full of the good mm -hmm. stuff. The problem I have with Ben & Jerry's is that there's always at least one thing in it that I don't like. They will nail five out of six add-ins and I will be in heaven and then they'll like polish it off with walnuts. And I'm like, why did you do that? <laughs> I think in this case, you go half-baked. I think I'm gonna go with my Dulce de Leche, I'm, but with rainbow sprinkles. You know you like it. And so, so I know it's gonna be a good time. To be honest, have you ever seen anybody take so much time and so much debate and thought and thorough research into choosing their ice cream? We just know the outcome is gonna be good though. Let's so. just say we don't take this stuff lightly, no. right? No. This is serious business. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right, guys, so we've got about 30, 40 minutes to walk back to the truck. <laughs> We parked a little ways out there. We've got our ice cream. We're on our way out. It's getting a little bit darker out here. So we're gonna do some night driving now. Step up that difficulty level just a little bit. Go with some night driving. Maddie actually says she feels a little more comfortable at night. Well, only like kind of like later at night because there's less cars on the road. Yep, you know? less cars, less distractions. It's actually a pretty chill area. There's not ever, like she's from yeah. California, you guys. She drives in San Diego. It yeah. is much busier there. On the slowest day where she lives, it's busier than the busiest day here. Let's yeah, be honest. Yeah, I mean, I've been noticing that there's significantly less cars on the road. You kind of have the road to yourself most of the time. Which is nice. Headed back to the truck. Matt is gonna do some night driving. We're gonna head home and get this movie started. We weren't able to get it at the red box, but it gave us an excuse to get in the truck, get some ice cream, and then we'll just do a digital download at home. And I can't say digital download without stuttering. Digital download. Digital download. Hashtag image. I think I see it. <laughs> <laughs> if you squint really hard. <laughs> Off in the distance. I guess you can come in. <laughs> Thank you. Seatbelt. Oh, gotcha. Both sides and the camera. Some of the you might not be able to see it. Almost like this one truck in the morning. So we're gonna, yeah, basically like a U-turn. You're just gonna turn left and come back down the street. Oh, stop. Okay, so when you come out here, this is a little bit busier road than we were on before. So higher speed limit, but nice wide lanes, not a lot of traffic. What the speed limit is. 45. So don't worry about grabbing the perfect spot. Just wait till there's tons of room. Yeah. There will be a big opening at some point. And the truck's got some good power, so if you make a wrong move, just hit the gas. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, it's got some power. <laughs> Sorry, that was a bit of a rough turn. No, it's good. It's great. When you get up to the stoplight, just turn left. I'm a new driver. Species. <laughs> Hello, I'm Maddie. I'm new at this. <laughs> I'm new in town. I'm driving. So this lane's gonna merge, so just make sure there's nobody to your left trying to pass you. Okay, there's not. And then you just kind of slide on over and you're good. This is fun. You're doing great. I, like this car. I think this car likes you. I want it. <laughs> Maybe this is a terrible mistake. <laughs> <laughs> my friend Wendy wants a truck so bad. Keep turning a little bit. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Have you done this a thousand times or something? It couldn't have been better. It just feels really slow going up this hill even though I'm going 30. Yeah, go faster. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, just gently tap the brakes. Doing good, doing real good. Real good. I'm in my mom's car. Vroom, vroom. <laughs> Get out my car. Uh. <laughs> Phenomenal job with the blinker light in that car. Know you're turning so they could safely come out from their stopping point. Well done, Maddie. Yeah. Textbook driving right now, I'm telling you. Maddie, we're home. You did it. Throw it into parks. So we don't run into the garage as we celebrate. All the way in. Maddie! Off by yeah, all by themselves, yeah. You Woo! did it, are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, we did it, you guys. A successful trip to get ice cream. I feel like I did pretty good. Amazing, there and back. Phenomenal. Literally, I have zero critiques, nothing to say. Just like definitely relax and don't be nervous about it because when you aren't, you just drive very naturally, very good. That was great. Nice Woo! Guys, we got our movie, we're in the basement and we are ready to rock some of this delicious ice cream and scary movie, Maddie and Dad style. But first, I'm gonna go with Maddie's advice and I'm gonna try some sprinkles on this ice cream. I think it could work. But just to be safe, I've got a variety pack. Three varieties of sprinkles here. And in case I like all three, I had to bring a backup just in case you never want to be left without sprinkles. Of course. So of course, I've got to bring in the big guns. Let's start this movie. <laughs> Can 
tell him that it's nighttime, late night. We all got our nighttime faces on. Maddie and I just wrapped up our super epic scary movie. It was actually pretty good, guys. Truth or dare? I liked it, a lot. it was actually pretty good. Our least favorite part of scary movies by far, Mindy oh knows my it. Gosh. Is that Mindy thinks it's the perfect time to come down and scare the crap out of us. You guys may have already seen the Mindy Scare Project. If you haven't, I will link that for you. But Mindy somehow gets a very funny rise out of scaring oh my people. Gosh. I scare you all the time. I she scare scares you, me like, all the time. Like every every day, probably. Which is very unfair because if I ever scare her, oh, no. which I did like once in our marriage, and she flipped out me. so hard you that I've never done it. in the shower. Yeah, I hid in the shower in the middle of the night. So when she got up to go pee, I jumped <laughs> out. Oh. <laughs> Okay, that's like pretty good. Really but I've never done anything again since, that's but she horrible. loves to scare me. In the middle of the it. scariest parts of the movie, she will just jump out from behind a corner, throw something at us, make loud noises, any number of things. So we do not enjoy that, but no, we do just, enjoy our ice cream. I find happiness in scaring you. <laughs> Comment below if you think I should do another scare project video. Should Mindy be working on her second annual scare project? <laughs> no, she I'll should not. We don't love that, but we do love our ice cream. Do love. Oh, oh man. Oh my gosh, that was. So oh boy, those are I'll all. I'll be good. back from tonight. You love our sprinkles. <laughs> okay, he's gonna go chat out on sprinkles. I'm gonna go to bed. We may or may not be working on some family picture ideas. Remember, comment below. Should we do family pictures? Let's just see if we can come up with it. We love you. Thanks for hanging with us today. You guys rock. Thanks for being the best part of all of this. Thumbs up for this video for Maddie's amazing driving. It was amazing. I actually didn't do that bad. Tomorrow, no. we're gonna chat up the mountainside in a razor. Don't miss it. It's gonna be epic. It might be a sneaky date for Maddie. We love you guys. Have a great night. We'll see Bye. you tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,